what this game drives me batshit crazy. The past is not lost. The past lives inside us. Encoded in the double helix are the experiences of our ancestors. After three decades of research, our engineers have forged the cutting edge of biotechnological interfaces. We have unlocked the lives of our forebears. We have opened a window into the Are we good now? This is Total Immersion Entertainment. With the press of a button, you will experience the most pivotal moments in history. All from the comfort of home. Welcome to Helix. Welcome to Helix. Is your playground. Welcome to Helix. Last of all. Alright. Should be a smoother experience. <clears throat> and if it's not, we'll blame it all on Mason. And no, we'll blame it on Tech Gladiator. Fair enough. He seems like, what? Blame it on me. What, you scared? Oh, I ain't scared. We'll blame it on you. That's fine. That's fine. I ain't scared. Ten tokens. Woohoo! Paris, France, October 13th, 1307. Yeah, well, yeah. You're like an MK god. Who goes there? A friend of the temple. Floarak, the council's message was absolute. You're not welcome here. I must speak with the Grand Master. He's in session. They all are. Another day, perhaps. King Philip disagrees. Damn you, man. Why you're not rocking in a cell at this moment, I cannot fathom. Dude just got stabbed. We are betrayed. Draw our swords, men! Defend the temple! Not you, brother. I have a different task for you. Come with me. Um. Do, 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 make fun of everybody. Okay, um, options. Gameplay? No. Uh. Sound? Subtitle. On. English. What is this? Blood effects. On. Companion app. Off. Rift guides. Join in progress. Uh, that options. Tutorials. It, uh, 
Phillips moving faster than we expected. Mm -hmm. Another hand is at work here. The Pope? The assassins. Assassins? I thought the Mongol Khans broke their power decades ago. The assassins are far older than Masia, my friend. Their anarchic delusions are very much as the plague, less easily eradicated. We will not prevail this night, but if you make haste, we may yet save our order. What must I do? Go to the tower. Take the sword and the book. Hide them. They must not fall into the assassin's hands. Run, master. Go! Go! Catch him! Don't let him get away! Man, Templars are so slow. Why you kill assassin? No, because uh, he's a Templar. Can't you let him kill you? No. Then it's game over. Don't worry, the assassin kills him. After he hides his sword in plain sight for, and thousands of years go by and nobody notices it's there. Good job. Good job. I wouldn't say thousands of years, but like hundreds of years. Nobody, nobody notices that glowing sword. <clears throat> the 
There, see? Yeah, the assassin still wins in the end. However, at the end of the last game, started where Arno's game starts. You know that, right? Like. Pope Clement, hear me? Before this year is out, you will answer for your crimes before God Almighty. And you, King Philip, no punishment is too heinous for the great evil you have inflicted upon the temple. Pretty good, you but no, you can totally do me instead. Curse you to the 13th generation of your blood! You just be cursed! Consumed in flames of hunger and wrath, thus came the age of true wisdom to a blistering close. The Knights Templar, once the proud shepherds of order, peace, and illumination, were no more. But they were. According to the game lore, anyway. Yeah, let's get a sniffer running. If Abstergo pings us, pull me out. Okay. I have a visual. Hey there. This is probably disorienting, so I'll be brief. I'm Bishop, not my real name, obviously, but that's as much as you'll get today. Please listen carefully. Abstergo is using you, hijacking your neurons to help them sift through genetic memory data. These guys don't have their fingers in countless corporations, governments, media outlets, and NGOs. But now, they want control over history itself. If that doesn't frighten you, it should. But we're here to stop them. Uh, I, I had issues with the PC. Deacon, preload or... gene sequence, uh, AD16, B13, I87. Yep, spooling it up. Last week, we gained access to a bank of unsequenced memories in Abstergo's Helix servers. For now, we'd like you to experience a small sample. This should help you understand our struggle. And after that, you can decide for yourself what comes next. Yeah, I did. We'll be waiting. Uh, severe stuttering and frame rate issues. Probably because I was streaming and trying to play it at the same time. Uh, this is PS4. Twenty seventh December, seventeen seventy six. Arno. Can't I go with you, Father? <clears throat> Courage, my boy. You wait just here. I will return when this hand reaches the top. That's forever. Not as long as all that. And when I get back, we'll see the fireworks. Well, I can tell you right now, Arno, the frame rate's been a lot better. Hmm? Say it. Yes, Father. Except the Shay is gonna kill you. Oh yeah, Shay is definitely gonna kill that guy. Whoops. 
Yep, poor pig. That's one horny little boy for his age. Just on a girl like that. Just saying, shit happened. Bet you can't steal one. Such a bad influence. I'll show you. See, I can steal one. Put that back. These are His Royal Highness, not the likes of you. Got you now. Do you? Damn it! The hell's going on? Put that away now. Wait, did the guard just like teleport over there? Oh, there he goes. What's up, dude? I'm ordering you to stand still. Are you ordering me to stand still? Good tell. When we stole those apples. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Arno. Elise. <laughs> I'm here with my father. So am I. He has important business with the king. With the king? What should we do now? Shh. <laughs> Listen. Don't worry. They'll never think to look for us in here. I'm waiting to turn around and see her face melt off. The apple. Except they updated it. But yeah, when this game first came out, a lot of people saw her face melt off. Smoochy woochies. Something's happened. I sincerely hope this unfortunate affair does not darken your opinion of our nation. Monsieur, if we judge nations Where is he? the character of their criminals, we should all call barbarians. Come here, girl. Now. Father? That's not Ben Franklin. I said Mr. Franklin. Where is he? <coughs> That's an antique boy. That timepiece, it's it's Timex. It's meant to tick forever. And you just broke it. Different uh, voice actor for Ben Franklin in this one? Yeah, but you only hear uh, him that once, and that's it. Look at me. And you only hear him, you, you don't see him, so. It's probably just one of their extras that they had. Like, we got to, you know, they added it in post-production or something. So you stoop the fever, you bastard! Calm down, Victor. I've only come for my watch. It's my watch. I want it fairly. Well, in a just world, Victor, I would agree with you, but this is not a just world. This is France. You're a dead man. Oh, step lightly there. You'll hurt yourself. That's me watch. I just had a nice chat with your brother. You go. 
Fetch the marshals. Hold on a minute. Diable. I've got it, Victor. Oh. I won't let him get it. I say. Sorry. Pardon, madam. Get out of my way! Move it! Gentlemen, please, we can come to an understanding. Please excuse him, he's not housebroken. Please excuse him, he's not housebroken. Damn. Missed. Gave me the prompt, though. The headed blacksmith like you probably can't even read or watch. Come over here and say that. Uh, no. Get back here. Mm, maybe. Keeping up. That's all right. This is okay. Nope, not going that way. Oh, can I stand with you guys? Thanks. Okie dokie, uh, calm down. Um, excuse me, excuse me. I think it was. <laughs> and if it was, I'll go back and redo it. But I don't think it is. Yeah, some of the games it is. I'm here. I'm and where in God's name have you been? Um, none of your business. <clears throat> Got you now, you little shit. Just a little misunderstanding. Nothing to. Your master's arbor in a common criminal. In broad daylight, he broke into my. Hey, go down. What's up, dude? My watch. 
Did he indeed? Well, I'm sure the Marshal C would be more than willing to sort this out. Oh, did you get your sense controller? A most serious accusation against your ward, sir. He robbed me. <laughs> of what precisely? Wait for me in my library. Don't give me that look. Victor cheats when he plays Pharaoh. Everyone knows it. Arno? Who are you talking to? No one, monsieur. You'll be happy to learn I persuaded Olivier to leave off calling the Marshalsea. Again. Je vous remercie, monsieur. What is this? The sixth time? The seventh? Perhaps a new hobby might be better for your health. Well, I find playing cards affords many opportunities for fresh air and exercise. <laughs> we'll talk about this later. I have business in town and must collect Elise before I can attend to it. Elise is here. Only for the night. She returns to Paris first thing tomorrow. She'll need an escort. Won't she with you so preoccupied? One of you running a mock is quite enough. By the way, he's a Templar too. Hey, asshole, what's going on, dude? Sure he does. What was that? Give my regards to Elise. Such a slob. What is this then? He's like a He's like a hipster. Uh Arno. He's got one sleeve up, one sleeve down. What's wrong with this guy? I oh, you know no better. Hey, Virage Star, what's up, my dude? <clears throat> you thrown out onto the street yet? Oh, you would love that, wouldn't you? It'd break my heart. Olivier, if I weren't here, who'd do all your work? Chilling, crazy week. The you horses need goes. brushing, boy. Ah! Uh, well, Gaspol says it's been a crazy week so far. He's French, so you're the original hipsters, well. He's French. But you can't tell by his outrageous accent. Ah, uh, the French Revolution, what a time. Yeah, I know. And that, so, and after this one, we'll play another revolution. Some trouble, mon ami. The industrial one. A letter for Sir de la Serre. It's very important. Oh, calm yourself, Perrault. Yeah, I saw your message. That letter won't reach Monsieur de la Serre any faster. Out loud. Drop dead of exhaustion. Give it here. I'll catch him. You must receive it today. It's very, very important. Yes, I heard you the first time. So much news, so much business money to be made. <laughs> Monsieur de la Serre, stop. The thing about GameStop look, is lad. it's kind of funny. You'll have to go around. <laughs> That's just people being like trolly. Damn it, slow down. And it's for good reason. Like it's teaching like uh in the stock market you you have what's called the uh Apparently, walnut is a popular finish this season. The short seller, or the, the guy that resells Dallas? super quick for maximum profit, and it's just teaching them a, a lesson by taking money from them. That's all it did. Got enough people with uh, money to. Uh, Control them bad enough to make that happen. Monsieur de la Serre. Please excuse one carriage. What I need is a mm -hmm. bird's eye view. Yeah. Uh, syndicate was done in the Industrial Re Revolution in London. Yeah.
Ah, I guess I do have to climb a tower. You're right, Tech. My bad. Okay, um, can we, uh, HUD options? I guess you can't turn off, like, fully turn off the, uh, tutorials, because that's not annoying at all. Yes, thank you for teaching. Oh, my God. I, I don't remember that being part of the game, like. Hidden. Any map shown. Mission log shown. Player widget. Hidden. Tutorials. Hidden. Yeah. Otherwise, I'd be seeing bases melt off. The Estates General. There you are. Hubba hubba. Hubba hubba hubba. Hubba hubba. Hmm. 
The thing about GameStop is they're, people are messing with the short chain sellers. It is very rare. What happened with the GameStop stocks? Okay, so the thing with GameStop uh, stocks is that they 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 spiked by a crap ton. Uh, people started buying up shares uh, because the the stock was so low, and so when it got up to a certain like it skyrocketed up. After so many people started buying stocks. Well. Then you have people buying. As it peaked. It, it, it got the major investors involved. As it peaked. And they were holding. They held on to it. While everybody else sold the peak day. And then it started coming back down and crashing. So all those short changers that bought it on peak day. Are losing a crap ton of money right now. That's that's kind of what happened in a uh, in a nutshell. Well, they they weren't realizing that they were buying on peak. They thought it was going to keep going up because of the uh, new consoles and stuff. But what I'm saying is short sellers do this all the time. And what happened is a lot of right. So what happened is, is a lot of people started buying when it was at its lowest. <clears throat> Right, so <laughs> what happened is a lot of average Joes started buying up a crap ton of GameStop, right? Like, like the internet. It, imagine like the internet is buying GameStop. Well, this grabs the attention of the short seller because the short seller thinks it's going to crash, right? And it's already at the peak because it, it's rising up from the crash. So it's already at the peak, and then. The short seller decides to get in on it at the peak when everybody else starts selling that same day. So the next day, the short seller goes around to sell it and he's lost a lot of money. Millions of millions of dollars. Like, that, that's typically what happened. It, because everybody was buying up so much stock, GameStop's stock rose like 1,700%. And the short sellers were late to get in. <laughs> Pretty much. And lost a whole lot of money. 
uh, basically it was a big target on short sellers. It left them, so what it did is it left them with bad stock that they're holding on to because they've already lost millions and instead of just cutting their investment they're waiting on for it to go up again while they're losing even more money uh basically you had a lot of people yeah had a lot of average joes getting really rich while the short sellers were losing a lot of money not these two again must have tailed me from the estate there you go asphalt just explained it right there basically wall street just got trolled hard so who or what would take its place another king a council of capable men that is the question isn't it a truce then what the devil was that about now now we can resolve this without recourse to violence can't we get him you go I suppose not. Get him, you Easy, big fella. Is it, Victor? To your health. Gentlemen. See, the trolls are Boy, controlling what. What are you doing there? Uh, running. They're, they're, they sold. The, the trolls sold their stock to the short sellers. <laughs> Everybody just walked around France, probably, with swords. Yeah, can't you see everybody walking around with uh, swords? Look at them, they're all armed. Actually, you know, it's not too far-fetched. If you think about it. I mean, everybody in the 1800s walked around with a gun in America. Well, in America, anyway. Back at home, I suppose. Yeah. I think it's. I think that whole situation is funny. The. Everybody still walks around with a gun in Texas, that's true.
Bonsoir, Olivier. Has Monsieur de la Serre returned? Senor de la Serre is not expected until late. Ah, well. I suppose I'll just pass the time with Elise, then. Don't get your hopes up just yet. Mademoiselle is at a private soiree, in her honor, at the palace. What? A party? I wasn't invited. Neither were the horses. <laughs> Neither was sure, the just horses. Just my invitation. I'll find my own way in. Ah, uh, how late is late? Perhaps an hour, perhaps three, perhaps not at all. I do not question the comings and goings of my betters. I'll just wait here then. The architecture in this game is just awesome. I could just slip it under the door. He'd see it the instant he returned. Le traité du monde et de la lumière de Descartes. Never could get through that one. Oh, oh. There. Safe and sound. And only slightly delayed. Should have read it. And now, to the palace. Ugh. I couldn't sneak through a sewer in these threads, much less a ball. Here, here, mon ami. Let me take care of that. Uh, well, thank you, young man. Wait, don't y'all work in the same house? You know who he is. Like, you know he's not gonna, like, take care of that brief. Uh. Yep. Probably. Shay was pretty ruthless and a dick. Maximilien Robespierre. No guest. Oh no. Le Chevalier du Telem. Invitation, s'il vous plaît. About that, I had one, of course, but on the way... No invitation, no admittance. Now clear the queue. Next, please. Charles Gabriel Sivet. Two guests. Next, please. Say he's not breaking in. Breaking and entering. The easy way. Quite the turnout. Quite! Let's just put in a short appearance to be polite. I'm tired. As you say.
complete shift change yet. Look at that one. Pretty sure his shoes cost more than my rent. Let me back in if I do. What? Certainly not. Well then, well, no. If it's all the same to you, I think I'll stay up here. You, come here. <sighs> I'll see you in the garden later. Yes, of course. Quite the turnout this evening. I can't remember the last time we were all together like this. It must have been that business with, um... And I would thank you not to speak of that. Madam. They're gold. That's not suspicious at all. Ain't got time for you, peasant. <laughs> Ain't got time for you, peasant girl. He's playing cat and mouse with that. She always did love the chase. You seem to have caused quite a commotion. Well, what can I say? You were always a bad influence. <laughs> oh, you were a worse one. Father's suit. Are you wearing a dress? <laughs> Don't even start. I feel like a mummy wrapped up in this thing. Must be quite an occasion to get you so fancy. It's not like that. Truth be told, it's a lot of ceremony and pontification. Doll is dead. Well, when you don't invite me to your parties, everyone suffers. I did try, but my father was adamant. Your father? <laughs> Go. I'll distract them. What? You're kicking me out. It's Complicated. I'll explain later, but for now, out the window. Oh, no, no, no. You're not turning this into a repeat of that apple orchard. Stop being such a baby. I'm sure there aren't any guard dogs this time. <laughs> Go! Still some little kid somewhere in me. Next scene, not for kids. Oh, is it not? Could have been on party duty, but no. Waste of time. There's nobody out here. I missed something? No. What the? Working too hard. Jumping a 
bloody shadows. Yeah, well, you know. Who's even going to come out here? Ten to one I end the night cleaning a rich man's vomit off my shoes. What if you don't leave the room? I'm sure you get uh, caught, right? You're all right, monsieur. Too much of the king's champagne. Monsieur. Monsieur de la Serre! Monsieur de la Serre! Sivir, come away! Guards! Help! Murder! Uh oh. And now he's been framed! Oh, Dieu! He's killed Lord de la Serre! Oh no! I've been framed! Now we gotta get all Harrison Ford on this bitch. And uh, flip a train and all sorts of stuff. This is a remake of The, the Fugitive, right? The one-armed man did it. Or in this case, the one-eyed man did it. It's a remake. <clears throat> Fugitive in the 1600s. <laughs> the one eyed man did it. <laughs> you guys are awesome, by the way. How many peeps we got in here tonight? Shout out. Shout it out. Nine. The Union story plot is one of the best. Yes, it is. It I love it. It wasn't me. It was the other guy with the knife. <laughs> that guy's completely naked in there. <laughs> There was no evidence? Yeah. Where am I? In hell. There was no DNA, you know what I mean? Like, fingerprints. 
Hey, Asuna, what's going on? How you doing? Pretty good. The justice system is still shit. Oh, yeah. I mean, he's not wrong. Welcome to your new home. That's reassuring. Where he stared at, Pisspot. You call him Pisspot. Parker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Still works. Thank God it's a Timex. <laughs> Thank God it's a Timex. What? Where'd you come by this, piss button? I'm in no mood for this. Give it back! Take it back. If you think you can. Wooden swords in jail? What if somebody gets killed? Well struck, Pisspot. See if your defense is as good. So much effort for a broken antique. The only I think that's the same voice actor that did Blackbeard and Forge. Actually, I'm almost certain it is. I've thought about it, but I think you're right. Yeah. Give me what's mine and go back to your crazy drawings, old man. Drawings. Bees here. Everywhere. Scribbled like chicken scratches all over this cell. Where? where? Come here, you little piss pot. Get your hands off me. Look at the wall. What are you doing? Concentrate. Concentrate. What are they? Messages from the past. I had myself thrown into after prisons in Paris in search of these. What's your name, boy? Arno. Arno Victor Dorian. Dorian. Of course. Pierre Belek. I knew your father. Arr, I knew your father. He died at Versailles. Well, 76, 77, December, as I recall, no witnesses. How did you... Your father was an assassin, Arno. He gave his life fighting for the liberty of all mankind. Yeah, the blood cleans up you for pet scenes on people that aren't supposed to die, except for, like, brotherhood. obvious entries like Honor that dude's lip. Memory. 
Listen, I'm sure your little cult is a delightful bunch, but I'm not interested. The only thing I care about is finding Elise. How are you planning on doing that from in here? Why would they give him wooden swords to get out? No, okay, so Arno's Arno's father was an assassin who was killed by Shay at the end of the last game. Remember, uh, Shay, uh, again. Shay killed his dad at the end of the last game. His dad was an assassin. A Templar took him in after his dad was murdered. Feeling pity on him. Keep That's Elise's father. Elise's father is a Templar. Or was. He got killed. That was cannon fire. Sometimes opportunity sounds a lot like cannon fire. Secure the prisoners. Follow my lead. Quick, this bomb before the guards come. Prisoners up against the wall. On whose authority? I told you this was going to end badly. Silence! Stay back! Jay Cormac killed uh, his father. Prisoners up against the wall. I forgot what his name was. Charles Dorian. Smoke bombs. One of them stabs me. I'll haunt you to the grave. Ah, much too slow. Trying to lose me. Oh, ah, you're mine. Belek, is the door open? Not quite. We have a problem now. Find a solution. Lovely. Yeah. Ah. Train in the use. Keep your heads up. After him. After him. Any time. Ah. Magic. Ah. Belle. Die already. Got it! Let's go, piss pop! Out the window. Come on! Go! He doesn't always go through the window. There we go. The 
this way! Fire! Fire, damn you! Get off the prisoners! Is he just going to stand there? Jump. What? Prison scrambled your brains, old man. Drake took care of that a long time ago. Now get up there! I can't! That's impossible! Impossible? That's the purview of every assassin boy! If you can pluck your head out of your own arse, come find us! Make a great fit. Goodbye, Fistpot! You! Back away from the ledge! <laughs> Title screen. Hours later. <laughs> that was a clean transition, though. I, oh yeah, man. Have, have you not seen this game, Orly? This game's really good. I, I know it got shit on when it first came out, but it's really good. Like the art direction in this game's great. The baked in lighting. Uh, they did a lot of things in this game that were way ahead of its time and it kind of broke on the new system on on the ps4 because it was so far ahead of the time and so when it came out it was a buggy mess uh but they fixed it and they worked on it and and it it ended up being great it's one of my favorite assets yeah this one's really good And it's got the best story Please? out of any of them, in my opinion. That's some welcome. One can't be too careful. But after what happened... Elise, I... Haven't you done enough to repay my father's kindness? Elise, please. You can't believe I killed Monsieur de la Serre. Your father... He wasn't the man you thought he was. Neither of our fathers were. I know exactly who my father was, Arnaud. And I know who yours was. I suppose it was inevitable. You an assassin. Me a Templar. You? Does that shock you? My father always meant for me to follow in his footsteps. Now all I can do is avenge him. I swear to you, I had nothing to do with his death. But you did. No. No! By my life, I swear I didn't! Is that...? A letter intended for my father the day he was murdered. Read it. I wasn't supposed to read his mail. Grandmaster de la Serre. There's no way Arnaud could have known. through my agents that an individual within our order plots against you. I beg you to be on your guard at the initiation tonight. 
trust no one, not even those you call friends. May the Father of Understanding guide you, El. I found that on the floor of my father's room. I know, Pin. I didn't know. Neither did my father. How could I have known? Just go. Please. But how could I have known? Could. There's no way you could have. Go! Oh! What's up, dude? How you doing? Hashtag heartbroken. Yeah, I know. Oh, it's good. Planning an awesome assessment. Hey, Notre Dame. Time to get your drink on, Arno. Time X is still working. The sterling silver uh, innards. <laughs> the devil is this supposed to mean? I am Madame Tussaud. I'm adept at making wax figures and death masks. I promised the assembly I would make masks of famous victims of the guillotine. It's grisly, but it was the only way to get out of prison. And now someone has stolen the heads I was given. Was lit you your favorite assassin? For me? Don't get me wrong, I love Assassin's Creed 2. But, uh... This game's awesome. Something you might find important. She sent me this letter. Sorry, madame. I have learned that a certain politician flushed with pride in his role overthrowing the guild. The, the Gerendans has produced the head of Jacques Pierre Brissot, recently stolen from you. Works near the concierge, your devoted friend. Plus you get to do these mysteries, which are really cool. Rumor has it that a soldier who guards Saint-Chapelle wanted the head of a limp de Gouge. He was in love with her from afar. The judge of the Palais de Justice who condemned Jacques Hébert apparently wanted Hébert's head as a trophy. Mm. But 
This is all slot. I'll see you later, Dash. I gotta retrieve all these heads. Thought I was doing it because I was crazy, didn't you? And yeah, the second time I was alerted and they kind of knew I was in there and it was automatic. But the first time it was because I got I, I, I've got to get the heads.
Don't worry, he'll live. No, it's not going to work. Oh, I should have let him go to the bell. I've already sabotaged it. Damn it. Haha, <laughs> I meant to knock him out. I got too close. <laughs> it's alright. I got the heads. That was operator error is what that was. That was your pee pee. Where's the stairs? Oh no. Oh no, there's no stairs. <laughs> Where are the stairs? You have them. I can make the death masks and be safe. Oh, what a world in which we live. There we go. Assassins don't need stairs. It's true. It's very true. Stop right there. Alright. We're not doing any more side quests until I get my hidden blades. We, we gotta get the hidden blades.
the hidden blade. I suppose a simple address would be too mundane. Even on PS4 though, tell me this game is not just beautiful. What's the light supposed to illuminate? If you can pluck your head from your own arse, come find us. Let me tell you something, brother. Check Gladiator. I'll tell you what I'm not playing on PC, brother. Damn it, Tech. Hello. Because the Sando Maniacs want it played now, not sometime next week. Alright. Let's Damn it, Tech. Damn it, Tech. What you gonna do, brother? Stando Mania and all the Stando Maniacs run wild on you. Damn it, Tech. Took you long enough, piss pot. What is this place? The sanctuary. A place we can train and prepare away from the eyes of our enemies. Didn't we just escape from a dungeon? It's not a dungeon. It's a nerve center. From these tunnels, we can get anywhere in the city, all without being seen. We have eyes everywhere. Really? 
Seems visibility would be a problem. Wouldn't you prefer something with a view? This place has served us well for 600 years, Pisspot. Mm-hmm. And how long were you standing in the dark waiting for me? Not long. Guillaume spotted you from the bell tower. Well, it was quite the entrance. Are you mocking me? No, no. God's truth. Very theatrical. Shut up. We're here. The candidate will approach. So, the son of Charles Dorian returns to us. The Lek thought you wouldn't come, but changed your mind. I'm tired of running from my failures. Monsieur de la Serre, my father. I want to make it right. The death of Grandmaster de la Serre weighs on you. Why? Did you wield the blade yourself? Does it matter? The blame still lies with me. Inna the Nubahu took Kilo Kailai. Hal Anta Muta Akidon Min? Anna Kathalik. Inna Ukadnirala Muajati El Muakama. Say Kunu Jaidan. He will be great. Out of the dark you come into the light. It From becomes light, a racing game? <laughs> the dark. Are you prepared to travel the Eagle's path? If that's a fancy way of asking, do I want your help? Yes. Then drink. Prepare to get trippy. This is an Ubisoft game. When some mysterious stranger tells you to drink something and you drink it. In all the Far Cry games and all the Assassin's Creed games. Shit gets bad shit crazy. Let's get stoned. And there is to be no mischief. Father! Where is that boy? I'm certain I don't know. We should be well away. Father, it's me! I'm here!
Yeah, I don't think it was that violent. Shay so just kind of went. enough to repay my father's kindness. You must receive it today. It's very, very I heard you the first time. Truly, I am blessed to have such a loyal ah! If you could pluck your head from your own arse. This kind of reminds me of the lineup in Batman Begins. Oh yeah, now I remember what I'm supposed to do. Sober up, piss pot. It's time to get the drugs out of your system. These are the words spoken by our ancestors. The words that lay at the heart of our creed. Stay your blade from the flesh of the innocent. Hide in plain sight. Never compromise the brotherhood. Let these tenets be branded upon your mind. Follow them. Be uplifted. Break them at your peril. Rise, assassin. Arno Dorian is dead. He has been culled from this world, and his sins and failures turned to dust. Tonight he is reborn, a novice of the Assassin Brotherhood. The drugs are doing to you? What if the drugs make make me a Templar? <laughs> well, apparently they did. <laughs> they just didn't. <laughs> <laughs> 
Hi. <laughs> oh, the story for this game, though, is so good. It's got layers, like an onion. Matter of fact, this is probably, I would say, the most complex story in all of the Assassin's Creed. So I think is why I like it so much. Because we're fixing to see some lines get blurred and grayed. We're going to see the Templars and the Assassins working together. It's going to be crazy. Welcome back. Now that you've experienced life as an assassin, are you willing to pick up the fight and join us? Deacon, load the file. Coming up. We looked at a media file from Afterga last month, and the information it contains is astounding. But we won't share these things with just anyone. By pressing play, you'll be joining the assassins. If you want to fight the Templar menace, if you're willing to save civilization from Abstergo's clutches, press play, sit back, Ready yourself what story would you recommend? Well, I understand the future lore and like why the Templars and Assassins are against each other. As bad as I hate to say it, you need to play all of them. But Did if you're just me? looking for one, good choice. Welcome to the Assassins. Initiate. In the 1950s, it was theorized that human DNA worked via the triple helix model. Some years later, the work of Crick and Watson demolished this theory in favor of the double helix. Today, we know the double helix to be indisputably the basis of all life. So why did the triple helix theory gain so much traction? Why did Rosalind Franklin's x-rays seem to confirm it? It turns out that their initial samples had been taken from small traces of precursor DNA, the rare genes of an ancient race embedded in our own. We now know that triple helix DNA is the foundation of the precursor genome. It is the genetic Rosetta Stone of our age. If we can crack it open, if we can sequence the full precursor genome, there is no limit to the knowledge we will gain. Using Animus technology, precursor history will be open to us for the first time ever. Ancient languages will be unlocked and ancient technology will be ours for the taking. Imagine what will be possible if we master the technology that underpins the pieces of Eden. Such discoveries would surpass 100-fold the splitting of the atom. Last year, we located a rich sample of precursor DNA in a donor whose genes contained human and precursor DNA at an incredible 25 to 1 ratio. Our work will begin with this sample. Our goal is to unravel the triple helix, sequence the precursor genome, and change the world for the better, forever. Welcome to the Phoenix Project. Dun dun dun! Those crazy Templars are really up to it. So, this is where we stand. Last year, Abstergo acquired the body of a man we call a sage, one of a rare breed of humans with a surplus of ancient DNA. This was the guy that was killed in the for more cool. sages in the present and in the past. The more <coughs> Abstergo finds, the closer they get to their final goal. We've blocked their recent attempts to find more, but Abstergo will not stop looking until they sequence a full precursor genome. So, why Arno Dorian? Why chase an assassin through the French Revolution? It turns out, at some point in his life, Arnaud came into contact with another sage. We need you to find out when and where these meetings took place. If Arnaud was present for this sage's death, it might lead Abstergo straight to his body. Naturally, we'd like to find it first. This is where you come in. It won't be simple. Genetic memory must be tackled in sequence to keep the data stable. But we're confident you're up to the task. And you won't be alone. Other initiates, assassins just like you, are doing their part to end this fight. If you need more training, more experience, Mad Max is really good. Call yeah. for help. All right. What up? 
played Mad Max twice. Go to the next sequence. I've got something else for you. The more time you spend with Arno, the more data we'll have to increase your synchronization with him and to activate his abilities. Here, have a look at this. See, I got two. What's this one? Let's go for the hill. Thick skin. One last thing. While you've been busy, I had Deacon do some poking around in Arno's memories. Seems he was a busy guy. See that symbol? That's a co-op mission. I play a lot of games multiplayer. I don't know about you, but I thought you'd like to mix it up a little. These are missions Arno ran with his assassin buddies, so they'll give you an idea of what our organization's about. Just walk into the glitch and you'll get all the details. I've marked them on your map. I might if you got it downloaded. play some co-op missions if got it installed.
What's the mission? The mission... Let's get your arse in position. Don't ask questions, piss -pop. I live to serve. Nice, Orly. Lord Guillaume de Roussel has generously agreed to our price of 40%. An act of desperation? What about the priest? He'll come around. <laughs> Your confidence is infectious, Siver. My boys will have the weapon ready. Here are the details. Make sure it goes smoothly. Of course. Make sure that it goes smoothly, cretin. And when have I... Murder! These bastards always have bodyguards. Well... Next time, do that before he starts screaming. Why do we hang about here when Sever still lives? He killed Monsieur de la Serre! Patience. Sever is not the target. Not today. Come on. Council's waiting for our report. <laughs> I got your ticket, Orly. I did two cover kills, why is it only counting one? I mean, it doesn't really matter, but...
Je crois que Denis commence par toi-même. Shouldn't we stop them? Stop them. Avoid them. Doesn't matter. There's always more fanatics. Can't save everyone, Pisspot. Well, there's a cheery thought. Remy found the Serapion's body in a courtyard not far from here. Stop to the front. I'll still be running when you're dead. Just trying not to strain your heart. Oh my god, he went through the door on the first time? No way. Notice he didn't do it that time. Alright, there we go. What's up, Slayer? How you doing, dude? Need a break? Run! Why? Why? Stop! Stop! Uh, yeah, we finished Black Flag and we finished Rogue, so. I can't believe this. We've not seen Seafair for a year, and you're letting him walk. All because his name wasn't on a bloody piece of paper. <clears throat> so funny. Someone's late, yeah. You are well, citizen? So what happens next? How much money do I have? <laughs> ah. 
Uh. Damn it. Where's the one I really want? Take this ledger full of Templar records to Mirabeau. Proceeds to do nothing with it. Why am I funny? What did I do? Wasn't us. He's a politician. I mean, I'm glad I'm funny, but what did I do? He thinks he can end the war between assassins and Templars. <coughs> revolution to a happy conclusion. And convince dogs and cats to live together in peace. And that's bad. What did I do this time? It's a self-aggrandizing pipe... Customs agents of France can rest easy. Oh. Arpino's dead. I don't remember what sound that Shaking was. Shaking down imprisoned nobles seems a bit out of his oeuvre. What are the Templars up to? If we hadn't spent the last year hobbled by your damn truce, we might know that. Here's a point, Honoré. The truce was with Grand Master de la Serre. The man's been dead for two years. Whoever's in charge now, you can be certain they aren't sitting idle. We might have learned more had we not allowed Siver to escape. Siver was there? I know your heart is set on keeping the peace, 
But bringing Monsieur de la Serre's killer to justice would count for something, wouldn't it? Yes, it would. But do not confuse your personal vendetta with a sound strategy. If he wants to kill Templars, let him kill Templars. I've done him all I can. Boys ready. Very well. Assassin. I charge you to go to Notre Dame de Paris and to find there the Templar agent, Charles Gabriel Sivert. You will learn his secrets, and when you have done so, you will bring him peace in accordance with our tenets. Yay. So, yeah, um, what do you guys think so far for those that haven't played this game? Hope you guys are enjoying it. Uh, I'm gonna have to call it a night tonight, though. Just because. How are you, Anna? That's the way this wacky world works. You like it, yeah? Did you ever play this one, Mason? I don't want to see too much, but the graphics look nice. I don't like the color of it. What do you mean you don't want to see too much? This one's super good. Yeah, skip this game, Kappa. Uh, no? It's one of my favorites? Not happening? Nope. 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 Nope, 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 nope. I like flew through Rogue to make this game happen. By the way, uh, I don't know if you guys notice where I'm at. But this is another dome. That I'm climbing and scaling all over. Little note, the spire wasn't actually on Notre Dame at this time, but other than that, it's a faithful recreation. And the reason they put the spire on here anyway is because they were afraid that people wouldn't notice or wouldn't recognize it without it. And I don't know if you guys know this, that um, they're actually using this game uh, to help rebuild a lot of Notre Dame because it got burned down. That's fat jack.
No, nobody's gonna bang me, junk, man. That's an that's that's an abuse of power. <laughs> I said, yeah, if you've got it downloaded, I will. I'm not playing it on PC, am I, you jerk? Shutters are closed. Oh, get up there. The shutters. So pretty. Trying to get my cat. <laughs> <laughs> 